Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome today to another FIFA 16 Legend Review. We're going to be taking a look at Emilio Butragueno. So then, the Spanish legend is 90 rated on FIFA 16. He's got 91 pace, 87 dribbling and 88 shooting. 5 foot 7 with medium low work rates, 3 star skill moves but a nice 4 star weak foot. Butragueno is a new legend on FIFA 16 so we've partnered him up with two other legends that were brought in this year uh, and the first squad option is this 4-1-2-1-2 side. It's cheaper in the defence and midfield options but then of course you've got that mighty legend strike force. And then another option for a team to Today is this 4-3-1-2 side. We've got the same legends up front, but we've got different players in the midfield and defence. The likes of uh, Inform Bonucci, the likes of Pogba, Rooney, Iniesta, all feature in this extremely formidable team. So it's in-game stats time. If you're watching on the YouTube channel, click that first link in the description. It's going to take you to the Spanish Legends page on the site where you can see his awesome in-game stats. Now, if I had to choose three stats which stood out for me in-game, I'm definitely going for 90 attack positioning, 92 acceleration, and 94 finishing. And this sums Butragueno up perfectly, leading me on to his pros and cons. Of course, we'll get the negatives out of the way first. The main problem with this guy, or he has two main problems. The first being his skill moves, only three star. You know, I've said it before. It means that you lack a bit of versatility going forward. But his main problem is his whole physical and strength aspect of his game. He isn't very strong. Only 60 strength in game can be a bit of a problem. He's a likely target to get pushed off the ball. And of course, he is only five foot seven which is very small. But the great thing about this guy is that he can use that height to his advantage. He's an extremely quick, tricky dribbler of the ball. Rapid acceleration, fantastic sprint speed, and great agility and balance too, which means he's got a great center of gravity. He's the sort of player which um, can turn on a sixpence. So great pace, great dribbling, great ability to dribble in and out and use his agility to his advantage. And then I also noticed that his passing game was strong too. Short passing especially. Yeah, I'm talking in uh, little one-twos between your cam and your striker. They seem to work very well. And then quite possibly the best bit about this guy is his finishing. His shots seem to have enough curve, enough power, enough... I don't know, long shot ability, and he always found the back of the net. He definitely feels like a 90 rated legend in the shooting department. So my advice to you, use this guy to his full advantage. Go on these mazy, tricky little runs, weave in and out of defenders using the no touch dribbling, and you'll have great success with him. Pick him up now on the ultimate team market, or of course in the foot draft game mode. Let me know how you get on, and I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll catch you next time. Peace.